assuming correctly now in, in some different areas, I'm going to talk about four areas. What we assume about others, what we assume about ourselves, what we assume about certain situations, and what we assume about the Lord. Do you know you can arrive at a conclusion about God based upon traditions and doctrines of man and come to the wrong conclusion? And I think it's important that we view who God is rightly. We make the right conclusion on who God is. And I believe what we know about God as we continue in this Christian walk, it'll be an ever-learning uh, situation. The more you go on in life, the more that you serve Him, the more you'll learn to know about Him. But along the way, it's important that we don't jump to the wrong conclusions about God. And i tell you what tradition does. It messes up and clouds our mind about who God is. It paints a picture of who God is when He isn't that person. i tell you, let God be true and every man alive. That's what the Word of God says. I'm going to stick with the Word. Thank you for listening to the Beacon of Truth broadcast with your host, Pastor Ruben F. If you need prayer, or if you've been blessed by today's message, please contact us and let us know you're listening. Write to Beacon of Truth Ministries, P.O. Box 9, Garnett, Kansas, 66032, USA. Again, write to Beacon of Truth Ministries, P.O. Box 9, Garnett, Kansas, 66032, USA. You may also visit us on the web at www.botmi.org or email us at pastor at botmi.org. Thank you for listening. And tune in again at the same time next week for another message from the Beacon of Truth broadcast. Have a blessed day. WHRI is now ending its broadcast at 9,830 kilohertz. Our next broadcast will be at 7,315 kilohertz. Thank you for listening to World Harvest Radio International.